Hello, welcome to another Facts and Dimensions tutorial video. This one I'm going to show you how to connect to the Power BI app, um, which is available online. That's the URL, app.powerbi.com. You need an Office 365 account to make use of it, and you need to click the free trial and or already have a paid for account so you can connect to external sources, as far as I understand anyway. Uh, you can see I'm logged in now using our Office 365 account. Um, so I'm going to just show you how to connect to the database. So cl click on Workspaces, New Workspace, Let's just give it a name. Then New and Dataflow. Uh, if you don't have the term Dataflow in there, that's because you need to be on a free trial or an actual paid version. Uh, the one you get with your Office account, that's free completely. You can only use, as far as I can tell anyway, you can only use it for importing local data off your computer. But if you want to connect to external sources, you need to actually use the proper account. And then this data flow option will be there. So click data flow, then define new tables. And you can choose a data source, and you can see tons to choose from, pretty great. Uh, as you know, um, you, our data is available in Azure SQL database. It's also available in Snowflake, um, but for this demo, I'm just going to use the Azure SQL database. So click that, then enter the details that you have for logging into our database. Okay, the server, the username. Sorry, the database name is your username followed by underscore user DB. Then I've already got a connection, but I'll just edit it so you can see. So. Uh, see username and the password that you've been given and then next um, and you can see all the tables that are in your Azure DB and then you just one you're interested in. I mean, from here, I guess you'd just sort of take over because I only really want to show you what to do um, to connect. So, yeah, that really concludes the demo. Thanks very much. Bye.